Hey, what's going on guys? This is Kedar here. All of my digital games is locked, they can't able to connect and I keep getting the error NP349 Fire-9. Why this error code is occurring onto my PS4? What's really going on? I tried activating my PS4 as a primary console right here into the settings but here you can see guys, when I tried to activate my PS4 as a primary PS4, it simply does not let me do that. It simply throws me the error NP349 Fire-9 and what's really going on with with my ps4 i keep getting this error all my digital content all my games are locked you see all the games are locked which i personally own so today in this video i'll be showing you how to solve this issue in a very easy step-by-step -step process so let's get right into all the details all right guys so here is the thing going into the settings i tried activating my ps4 as a primary ps4 to access all my games and all the stuff but here is the thing while i tried to do that it doesn't simply let me activate it again clicking on activate here you can see it throws me the error np349 fire-9 and all of my content simply stays locked i can't able to access my games all the things basically ps4 like a dread brick in fact i checked it out this fellow is getting the exact activation process how to activate the ps4 as a primary ps4 upon following the steps of activation all it gives you this np349 5 9 error first of all let me tell you you are not alone facing this issue there are tons and tons of users facing this np349 5 9 error in fact let me show you guys this is the reddit post how many people are reporting just 12 hours ago this post one hour ago 20 hours ago one day ago so this is a very hot topic as of right now for the playstation 4 many people are reporting this particular error and it's the same exact error and we have got couple of fixes and other workarounds but the first fix works flawlessly so let me show you that first of all i can totally understand the anger of the people is the licensing related issue the content is there it's locked due to playstation network servers can't able to access and restore Storing license doesn't work well so that's why people are frustrated but don't worry guys we have got this very easy fix so let me show you how you can do it all right guys so why this error is occurring is due to your games your playstation is not able to access the psn servers i checked out the psn network status now i don't know they could be lying but here is the thing playstation network all services are up and running i will not go into the depth how many people are reporting the same exact error like there are tons and tons of people reporting the same exact error so it could be psn problem but we have got a trick how to solve it so let me show you there are multiple reasons why you are getting this error but particularly your playstation can't able to access psn servers either your internet connection having issues playstation hardware or software but here is the thing guys as far as i can see the issue lies in one important setting that you need to change and this issue will be gone now this trick found out by a fellow reddit user he's like a god coming to rescue and luckily this process worked out for tens and tens of people it works like a charm so let me show you how to fix this one the problem lies with your dns so you need to head over to your playstation network settings and change your dns how you gonna access your ps4's network settings let me show you go to ps4 settings menu select network tab then choose the setup internet connection either you are using wi-fi or lan select whatever you are using then you need to select an ip address settings right over there then choose custom option because we are going to say set some custom parameters now for the dhcp host select do not specify and for the dns settings you need to set it to manual so that we can change the dns now like i mentioned earlier you can change your primary dns to 1.1.1.1 and secondary dns to 1.0.0.1 but here is the thing guys for many people these dns are not working so let me show you alternate dns that might work out for your region so 1.1.1.1 is basically the cloudflare dns which should work out for 99 percent of the people so try this first if this doesn't work then i recommend trying bunch of other dns like google dns so it will be 8.8.8.8 or 8.8.4.4 as a primary and secondary dns so you can set those or you can set 76 76.2.0 76.76 10.0 but for the fastest experience try this one first this one second and if both of those didn't work Work, then try this third option and after you're done with setting dns do not click on test internet connection and you should be good to go if this video was helpful make sure to hit that like let other people know do comment below make sure to hit that like share this video subscribe and, and this is kedar from how to guys see you in the next video